big weekend ahead of you, some familiar territory, somebody you faced before. Yeah. Uh, I kind of noticed the, both the Friday night event and your, your event, uh, so rematches. Is there anything about having faced them before that gives you more concern or confidence coming out of that night? Well, I got to learn from uh, past experience. Obviously, he's gotten better, and so have I. So I'm looking to go out there and show a dominant uh, version uh, going up against him and closing out the rivalry between us because it was a close fight. Um, one thing about the last fight that stood out, obviously, the, uh, uh, when you faced each other last time, uh, you know, they, they, they kept focusing on the leg kicks. Um, is there anything that you're, you're going to do different as far as like, what you saw from that Absolutely. Fight? I think you'll see a totally different uh, version of how I handle those leg kicks. And uh, one thing, I'm trying to ask you without being redundant, because I feel like you've been answering the question for the last two weeks, but are you getting tired of people asking you about retirement or anything like that? No, um, I mean, it's, I know it's on people's minds. Uh, they've kind of put me as, uh, you know, finished, but I want to go out there, use that as motivation, and, and really put a statement out there with my performance, and, and just, uh, you know, let people know that their opinion was, uh, wasn't so right, and uh, that I have a new uh, fuel in my fire. You think, um, I, mean, I know you had mentioned your faith, and, and uh, you had prayed on, on what you said last time. Um, is there, do you ever get any pushback from people? Somebody that represents like, personal faith in combat sports, is there ever any negative pushback? A, a bit, yeah. I mean, there's always going to be persecution when you stand up for for the truth and you stand up for Jesus. It's, it says it. It's, it's, it if you if you uh, you know if you if you're a follower of the Lord Jesus Christ, you get, you're going to get persecution. But I mean, it's such a small. It's so small in comparison to. Uh, the blessings uh, that I, I receive as a follower of Jesus Christ and having God care for every situation I have, it gives me the power through His Holy Spirit to go through those those uh, persecutions and uh, yeah I mean it's a little bit but if anything it's been more uh, a lot of people have come out and supported it or said that they inspired them and that's that's the goal you know to let people know and that, it, it, that they can they can experience the Lord, they experience His love, uh, press into Him, have a relationship, and watch God work in their lives and change their lives, like He did for me. Yeah, I mean, it's not it's not new to combat sports. How many times you see a fighter win, and their their first thing they do is thank God. Yeah. So, um, oh, do you think people kind of miss the point that you have a platform where you can actually uh, bring more people to? Recognize faith as, as uh, something that's empowering. They, they'll, they'll miss it. Uh, what do you, you said to, that they would miss it. You think they missed the point? Yeah. When when, uh, when you when you talked about uh, stepping away, like people kind of miss the point that you're in a position to to show that uh, oh. there's empowerment through faith. And yeah. You're on, on this platform of comments. Uh, I'm really not sure. I think I think because I made it public, and then. Coming back from that confused version and, and and giving my testimony that the Lord actually He cares about what I'm confused about, what matters to me, and He provided He shone a light on how I could be used in this and and uh, be an example, give my testimony, tell about the good news on this platform. So it's in the public eye now, and people got to witness where I was and. and where I'm at now, and where I'm going, and they can apply it to their lives. That's great. Um, one, one last question is a shift from what we just been talking about. But are you still doing? Uh, was it Dash sponsorship at the crypto? I did it just the once. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, because it seems like the numbers are down. Yeah, the, I think the whole crypto market's down a lot yeah. from the highs of back then. But yeah. All right. Cool. Well, good luck to you on Friday. All right. Thanks, man.